हेलो स्टूडेंट्स समग्र शिक्षा सिद्धिपेट प्रेजेंट्स आर वर्ल्ड थ्रू इंग्लिश क्लास एट पेज सेवेंटी वन यूनिट फाइव ए रीडिंग द ट्रेजर विद इन रीड द फॉलोइंग इंटरव्यू इट इज बेस्ड ऑन अ कॉन्वर्जेशन बिटवीन एम एस बेलराजा एडिटर ऑफ sparsh a newsletter from the resource center the valley school bangalore and mr half is contractor one of india's leading architects part 1 hc i used to have this terrible nightmare only now over the last 4 to 5 years it seems to have disappeared br what nightmare are you talking about and why do you think it has disappeared now hc i used to get continuous nightmares about appearing for a maths examination where i did not know anything now the psyche must have gotten over it i don't have to think about education and there is absolutely no time to get nightmares br tell us something about your earliest memories in school hc in the first and second year i was a good student After I reached the third standard I simply lost interest and I never studied I used to be interested in games running around playing jokes and pranks on others I would copy in class during exam times I would try to get hold of the examination paper that had been prepared and study it as i could not remember things that had been taught to me in class however later one sentence spoken to me by my principal changed my life when i approached my 11th standard the principal called me and said Look here son I have been seeing you from day 1 you are a good student but you never studied i have taken care of you till today now i can no longer take care of you so you do it yourself he talked to me for 5 minutes You don't have your father your mother has worked so hard to bring you up and paid all your fees all these years but you have only played games now you should rise to the occasion and study I used to be a very good sportsman I had been the senior champion for so many years and i also was the cricket captain i used to play every game but that year i did not step out onto the field page 72 i would go for prayers and all i would do was eat and study i normally used to copy and pass but I realized that once I was in SSC I could not do that when I got a second class 50% in my SSC my principal said son consider yourself as having got distinction this is my memory of my school days i did lots of other things see as far as my things are concerned i can't remember i forget things very easily to remember 
I have to see things as a photograph. I read a book and I can remember the matter as a photograph, but not through my mind. That is how it works. Br. When you were in school and you were doing badly, did the teachers pull you up and how did you feel? Hc. I never felt anything on being pulled up. I used to be so interested in playing, I would receive a caning every week. Br. When you knew that you had incurred the wrath of your teacher by not doing your homework or by behaving badly, when you knew you would get a caning, what was the state of your mind? Hc. State of mind? Just lift up the hand and they would cane you. It would hurt badly and then I would have to forget about it because I would want to go and play. Br. Have you ever felt insecure or threatened? Hc. I was just interested in playing and nothing else. I was most interested in funny pranks. One day, I did not want to study. So, I created a distraction. For one whole hour, we played chore police. Every Saturday, we were allowed to go into town to see a movie. So, what I would do was have no lunch and collect money from 40 to 50 students and run and buy the tickets. On my way back, I would eat to my heart's content. I used to be the leader of a gang. We would have gang fights and plan strategies. These things used to interest me more than any academics. Students used to book my textbooks for the following year because they were almost brand new. I probably opened them one day before exams.